A long time ago in my DBA youth, I wandered the web looking for truth. On a secret server farm, lonely and bleak, found I the angel of truth I did seek. A radiant figure whose name, it was Nuth. The angel Nuth brought me my desire. He took me on a journey through routers unknown to a cold black gateway, fearful and dire. Written upon it were words made of, words made of fire. Threw me past into the sight of downtime, threw me past into eternal overtime, threw me past and moan ye in fear, all updates abandon ye who enter here. Through the gateway were tortured souls, DBA and op staff, condemned for their sin. Quoth Nuth, here is truth, let us begin. In the first circle were fat, lazy slobs, whose great inertia had cost them their jobs. I don't need deployment scripts, that's too much work to get done. I'll just run the steps by hand. I know I won't forget one. And about those change docs, why for do you task me? If you need to know what a step does, when you need it, you just ask me. For their just reduction, they were assigned IKEA furniture without instruction. <laughs> In the next circle were parsimonious misers who listened only to their financial advisors. Buy cheap staging servers. No one will know. They're not production, they can be slow. They need not RAM, nor disks, nor updates. Ignore you QA, those greedy upgrades. That old production server that does stutter and crash is just what the man ordered to save the dev budget some cash. Hard on the heels of these miserly fools, great slobbering gluttons farted and drooled into their gaping maws. They greedily ate software requests and deployment updates. Update it, install it, do it ASAP. I'll have a kernel upgrade and a new shared Liber 3, a fat Python update, and four new applications, and then for dessert, 16 DB migrations. These fat and these greedy, for their sinful tricks, were assigned to install all of Microsoft.net on a 386. In the next circle, awash with dramas, coated scornful sinner prima donnas. Need I no tests nor verification? Behold my code, kneel in adulation. Ro rollback scripts are meant for lesser men. My deployments are perfect as ever again. They were taught to learn what perfection really means by debugging outsourced code from China and the Philippines. In the next circle, eyes bulging with lust for the new, these avid Reddit junkies only the cutting edge would do. On production servers, these wretches had deployed all of the most cutting edge platforms and tools they enjoyed. New releases, alpha versions, compiled from source. No documentation, no packages, and untested, of course. Obsessed with the new to a degree most frantic, on an experimental flying machine, they must cross the Atlantic. These envious bastards each tooted their own horn, treating their coworkers with hatred and scorn. I cannot stand meetings. I will not do chat. My scripts all are perfect. You can count on that. I only want to keep clear my name. If my coworkers fail, then they'll take the blame. Since they like being lonely, eschewing chats, meetings, and talks, they are assigned to be mimes in a box. In the final circle are the sinners most dire, whose great wrath did consume them like fire, when failed the deployment again and 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 again they did try, frantically debugging each step on the fly. They would not roll back. They ground on all day and all night. I know that the very next time we try it, the deployment will be all right. For this grievous sin, there was no penance to mend them, except to let them keep trying the deployment which condemned them. You have all seen for your education and enjoyment the seven deadly sins of software deployment. To avoid DevOps hell, avoid sin, keep to heart these seven virtues of an agile software art. <laughs>